Could you tell me what is the common point between a mandarin, an artificial satellite, Europa, a moon of Jupiter, and a black hole at the center of our galaxy? Hmm? So, I take the mandarin, I drop it, it falls. The artificial satellite is circling the Earth. Actually, it is pulled by the center of the Earth, and at the same time, it has an horizontal velocity. So it is actually falling, but because of its horizontal velocity, it cannot reach the ground because the Earth is round. Europa, the moon of Jupiter, is actually a big ball of ice. But because of its proximity to Jupiter, there are tidal forces, and these tidal forces malax the center of the planet. Therefore, the layers of ice which are underground get malaxed too and transform into water. They melt into an ocean, and in this ocean, there could be life. And what about the black hole? Well, you know that the galaxy is a group of billions of stars. What do you think holds all these stars together? Yes, the attractive effect of the black hole at the center of the galaxy. This effect provides a kind of immaterial glue that holds all the stars together and preserves the galaxy's structure. So what is the common point between all these things? Yeah, I suppose you've guessed by now. It's gravity. And this is what this course is all about. This course contains six sections. Linear motion, Newton's universal law of gravitation, gravitational fields, circular motion, orbital motion, and in the last section, there is a summary of it all followed by a quiz. Yes, a super quiz with 12 fun questions for you to train your new knowledge. All sections are composed of lessons, exercises, fun scientific anecdotes, and a ton of tips on how to approach questions and problems. The content of this course complies with high school physics programs like the IB or the A-levels and many more. So it has a little academic touch to it. But don't worry too much. In all exercises and lessons, I blend in some excitement in order to keep the whole thing interesting. If you are a high school student taking physics, or just someone that is interested in understanding the world around you, this course is for you. So now, tighten your seatbelt and let's get started.